Fiat money is essentially currency that gets its value not from a physical commodity, like gold or silver, but from our collective trust and confidence in the issuing authority. Think of it as a promise from the government and says, this is worth something because we say so. It's quite the leap of faith, isn't it? Unlike commodity money, which holds intrinsic value, fiat money's worth comes purely from our agreement to use it as a means of exchange. It's legal tender, accepted for paying debts and taxes, purely based on our trust. Diving into history, the tale of fiat money begins in the 11th century in China, during the Song Dynasty, with the issuance of Jiaozi, the world's first paper money. Initially backed by gold or silver, this early currency eventually moved away from any physical backing, setting the stage for fiat money. Fast forward through time, it's not until the 20th century, especially post-World Wars, that fiat money really takes to the global stage. Countries moved away from the gold standard to better control their economies, culminating in 1971 when the US dollar shed its gold backing, leading a shift to fiat currencies worldwide. This momentous change meant more control for governments over their monetary policy, truly reshaping global finance and trade in profound ways. Fiat money is a bit like the Swiss army knife of economic policy, offering governments and central banks the flexibility to tweak interest rates and money supply on the fly. This agility is key for navigating economic ups and downs, allowing for rapid responses to crisis that can help stabilize and stimulate economies when they need it most. Plus, making fiat money is cheaper than producing commodity-based currencies, meaning less cost for more financial maneuverability. Yet, it's not without its pitfalls. The absence of a physical commodity backing the fiat money means that there's a constant tightrope walk to avoid inflation. The currency's value hinges on government stability and policy wisdom. Shake the foundation, and you risk public confidence and, in worst-case scenarios, hyperinflation, as seen in historical episodes in Germany, Zimbabwe, and Venezuela. In a nutshell, fiat money is our economic linchpin, powerful and pivotal, yet demanding careful stewardship to harness its full potential and avoid its perils. Imagine a world where the value of money in our pockets relies purely on trust. That's the realm of fiat money, used globally and marking a pivotal shift from gold-backed currencies. I'll take you on a journey through the powerhouses of fiat currency, the US dollar, the euro, the Japanese yen, the British pound, and the Chinese yuan, each crucial in the dance of global finance. We're part of a system built on belief, enabling transactions and powering economies worldwide. As we dive into the digital age, you and I are witnessing alternatives like cryptocurrencies and gold challenging fiat's reign. Yet, the core of money remains constant, a medium of trust, whether digital code or a paper note. Diving into the world of currency, we find ourselves navigating the intricate dance between fiat money and its alternatives. In the grand scheme of global economies, fiat currencies dominate, serving as the cornerstone of daily transactions and international trade. This dominance comes with its set of challenges and lessons, notably in managing inflation. Historically, countries tethered to the gold standard, a form of commodity money, enjoyed periods of lower inflation due to the direct link between money supply and gold reserves. In contrast, the flexibility of fiat currencies unanchored by physical commodities can lead to higher inflation if not carefully managed. Yet, with prudent monetary policy, even fiat systems can maintain stability. Many developed nations have indeed kept inflation at bay over recent decades. Turning our gaze to the global market stage, the volume of trade conducted with the fiat money vastly overshadows that of emerging alternatives like cryptocurrencies. Despite their growing popularity and unique benefits, especially in cross-border transactions and as investment vehicles, cryptocurrencies still play a minor role compared to the entrenched fiat system. However, the journey of fiat money hasn't been without its turbulence. Economic crisis from Zimbabwe's hyperinflation saga in the 2000s to the great inflation in the United States during the 1970s underscore the delicate balance required in fiat currency management. These episodes remind us of the potent effects of monetary policy and the vigilance needed to navigate the economic seas. As we explore the complexities of fiat money and its impact on global economics, we're reminded the continuous evolution and challenges 
in the quest for financial stability and prosperity. As we peer into the future of currency, the evolving landscape presents both challenges and opportunities. Digital currencies and cryptocurrencies are stepping onto the stage, offering a radical departure from traditional fiat money. Their appeal lies in decentralization, enhanced privacy, and a break from government oversight, attracting those disillusioned with conventional banking and monetary policies. Simultaneously, the march of technology is reshaping how we interact with fiat money itself. Innovations like digital payment systems and blockchains are revolutionizing transactions, pushing central banks to consider central bank digital currencies or CBDCs. The CBDCs aim to merge the best of both worlds, the digital currency's efficiency and flexibility with the trusted regulation and stability of fiat money. Amidst these shifts, a debate rages on. Should we revisit the idea of commodity-based currencies, cherished for their intrinsic value and historical steadiness? Or is the future digital, embracing cryptocurrencies for their ability to streamline, decentralize, and innovate our financial systems? As we stand at this crossroads, it's clear that the dialogue between tradition and innovation will shape the monetary landscape of tomorrow. The journey of fiat money from paper and coins to digital digits reflects our ongoing quest to balance stability with progress, privacy with regulation, and tradition with innovation. In this dynamic narrative, each step forward invites us to reimagine the essence and future of money itself. Navigating the journey from the ancient inception of fiat money to today's digital currency era reveals a world where trust forms the cornerstone of our global economy. Fiat money, devoid of intrinsic value, holds power through our collective faith and governmental backing, enabling economic flexibility and resilience. Yet, it faces challenges from inflation and requires a vigilant management to maintain stability. The digital age introduces cryptocurrencies, promising decentralization and innovation, challenging traditional fiat currencies and sparking debates on the future of money. As technology advances, we're at crossroads, exploring the balance between tradition and innovation, with central bank digital currencies or CBDCs bridging old and new. This exploration of money's past, present, and future invites us to reimagine its essence and role in society. As we ponder these shifts, remember to subscribe and join the conversation on navigating the evolving landscape of currency.